soul that sin shall die. Look, by the way, the Old Testament is not abrog abrogated. The Old Testament is not abrogated. The reason being, Jesus said, and correct me if I'm wrong, I did not come to abolish the law, but to fulfill it. What fulfillment, okay. Okay. What, uh, allow, allow me, allow me yeah. to finish, like I allow you. What fulfillment of the law is there when one innocent person is put to the cross? And this innocent person, as you know, preacher, what he said, My God, my God, why have you forsaken me? Okay, so your question is, uh, the soul that sinned, it, it must die. All right. Uh, God, God's righteous, I mean, that has its place. The Jews were, <coughs> the Jews were perverting, the, uh, just like Christians today. They're abusing what Jesus did. So it's a license, they use that for a license to sin. We know now in, that now in Christianity, they're now, uh, there's lesbians, there's homosexuals, and these are, pa they're ordaining these as pastors. So the grace of God, they're, they're turning the grace of God as a license to sin. We see that in the epistle of Jude. Jude wrote to this, turning the grace of God in, into sin. As, you know, the, the hell will be so much hotter for these people because they are crucifying Jesus all over again. For example, I mean, I was once, uh, before I was, uh, in, my, in my youth, before I was 19, before I got saved, I didn't realize that it's my sins that nailed Jesus to the cross. Now that I know, and now if I sin again, now it's though, as though I crucify Jesus afresh. So, so, That's why he had to die. Uh, uh, the, the, so the death believe, of Jesus is a vicarious so believe, in place of, to fulfill, to, to uh, appease the wrath yeah, of God. Yeah, but you still, and, you and still you deny are, that, you, are you still under the old law or not? No. Why? No. So, the, so he came to, as you said, uh, you to quoted, fulfill. To fulfill. Okay, the law makes no, the law is, is the law. You know, so, I mean, so, it, it so, makes no. So, why so the Peter, soul, Peter and James, Peter and James and all the others used to keep the Sabbath? Why? These Why are the they? disciples. They, these are the they, disciples they, that they, were was, with him. It was the uh, apostle Paul, who is the apostle to the Gentiles. Yeah, God, but, but, God revealed His will specifically to the Gentiles. Uh, but, but to Peter, the so, Peter, so Peter was not. Peter was not. <laughs> was, was, was not. Uh, was not preaching to the Gentiles. We know. No, we know Paul that was, Jesus. Paul was. The, Paul was Paul's the Paul, apostle to the but, Gentiles. But Paul came. Came after. Well, well, we know the the famous story of Paul on the way to Damascus. All right. He saw. He said that he saw something. People with him. They saw. We never saw. We heard. And that there is conflicting evidence. Well. Then he say. Then he went to Jerusalem, and from Jerusalem he went to Arabia. So, so there is there is a lot of conflicting evidence regarding Paul in Acts. In Acts. So in Acts he says uh, he says that he uh, he didn't go to uh, to Arabia in Galatians he says that he went to Arabia. No, now, it's oh, just it's not conflicting. It is. Just, it is. No, three it years. The Bible. Three years. It just proves the Bible that it's inspired by God. If it if you have How an accident, how can it be inspired by God? Listen a little bit. If you have an accident, four people. There's a oh, at this corner and a person over here and a person over here and a person over here. They see the accident four different points of view. All right. So if if uh, the Bible proves that it, 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 there was not a conspiracy, so these people, as they give a report, it, it, this person sees it from his angle over here and the other person here. Now, if they wanted to prove that the accident really happened, they would get together and make sure. Hey, let's make sure everything is precisely. There's no conflict in what in our story of what we saw here. See. The, so the Bible. The Bible, each author uh, complements, complements the other author and uh, the other author. But if we you have want to pick and pick the Bible, you can no, do that. No, but no, the no, Bible no. also is a filter. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. Only wait. a few will be saved. The other uh, who preacher, no, wait. Many people who wait, preacher. We have got Luke. Luke you is have... the fi Luke. Yeah, Luke, okay. Luke is the physician of Paul. Is his maybe, physician? Maybe it he doesn't was... really bring okay. that out, but maybe. But he I was he was his companion, wasn't he? 
There was a companion of uh, Paul. We know that. Probably. We know that. We, we he was really, him and Bar uh, him and Barnabas were the companions of Paul. Barnabas, of, oh, Barnabas yeah. and Paul were companions. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And Luke was with him. He was his physician. Yeah, prob okay. Well, we don't know. Now that. we have got. Now that, we that have got. Now we have got Luke, who is saying about Paul that he went to Jerusalem and then from Jerusalem and uh, no he went to Damascus and from Damascus he went to Jerusalem to meet the Apostles now we have got Luke himself in Galatians saying okay I never went I went to Damascus I'm from Damascus to Arabia for three years now how can this be God inspired you're you're nitpicking. I'm not nitpicking. That's, you can I'm do that. You can do that. I'm you not can nitpicking. nitpicking. But I'm sure there's an answer. I'm not going to nit nitpick the Bible on those little <laughs> you issues. You have to. Like you that. have no, to. No. You have to answer. Is, the Bible is uh, uh, is inspired, and uh, people just like the doctrine of the Trinity. Uh, they're now translating the Bible to substantiate that corrupted and evil doctrine. So. So, but the Bible in its original text uh, is, is I, I would say, without error, because holy men spake as they were inspired or moved by the power of God, which is the Holy Spirit. And uh, so through translation, you know, uh, you know, if if you want to, if you want to pick, you know, nitpick the Bible, you know, but the original text. As you haven't written. got you haven't got an original text uh, preacher. All right, well that's a well, you but, haven't got God, an, no, God, this is the problem. Fit that the, no, but this is the problem. You haven't got an original text. The earliest that you have got is uh, the the the, gospel, uh, the Sinaiticus uh, Codex. Yeah, but let's see this original. The, the, know, this, the, yeah, but let's see this. At the beginning of my of uh, of the gospel according to Mark, they say this is the gospel or the evangelium of Mark of Jesus Christ the son of god okay the son of god this right. is at the beginning of okay. uh, all right now all your all your academics all your academics. scholarship yeah okay all your scholarship they say that this is an, an uh, it's an interpolation the reason is because what, it is what exactly is an the son of god so, the, the 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 word in son of god okay. it was interpolated into the the uh, to marx the gospel according to marx now now, the Gospel according to Marx, when they found the Sinaiticus uh, Gos uh, Codex, this word in the Son of God is not amongst that. So you said it's inspired. I can give you one. I can give you one proof after the other that it's not God inspired. You well, you have got I, the synoptics. I I, uh, I received. Uh, uh, I, I don't know how, I'm not going to get into academics with you. I know what I've experienced. I know what gives me peace. And uh, I was born in a, and raised in a very religious family. And I'm so thankful that, uh, kind of like the Apostle Paul, I was arrested. And knowing that there's a, or believing that there's a hell and a heaven. And I knew that I didn't have peace with God. And I searched and then God revealed himself. Uh, revealed Jesus to me, and uh, you cannot persuade me any different. But look, I I would say to you that you're you're gambling. You don't really know that you're saved or not. You're just hoping. I tell you, that's I tell how you, I was raised too. I tell you, but, I tell you what I believe. I believe in in what in what uh, what's his name Peter said. Okay. Okay. He said in Acts two twenty two. Yeah, right. Hear you, Israelite. Yeah. Jesus of Nazareth, yeah. a man approved, accredited, approved, approved or accredited of God. of God by signs, wonder, and All miracles right. amongst so, you. But, uh, yeah. But, so I believe that there was a man, as Jesus himself said in uh, in Mark in Mark six four. He said, "A prophet is not welcomed in his hometown." Yeah. I believe he's well, a prophet. I'm not welcome I in believe, my hometown either. I believe he was he was a great prophet. Yeah. I believe that he ascended to heaven. Right. So if 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 this ascension to heaven and that he is a prophet, as it is as it is mentioned in the Bible and the New Testament, then I'm saved. But if there is a tomorrow after death and you and you stand in before the Almighty and He tells you and you find it's other thing, 
then you have lost. There is no second chance, preacher. Well, I, I realize that. I was once lost and I, I tasted death, all right? And you will never convince me any different because I found peace. Jesus said, He that believeth in me, as the scripture hath said, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. And uh, you will never persuade me. I know in whom I believed, and, and uh, yeah, but, the but, time will come when they, I will probably die for my religion, for what I believe in Jesus Christ, because we're, we're living in the age where they want to put a mark on every human being. What are you going to do when they come and when they put a, want to put a computer chip in your right hand or in your forehead? I'll be gone by then. No, you're not. I'll be gone no, by then. I don't then. think so. That's I'll very be gone close. by then. The world is going to be plunged into World War III. And uh, after that, Richard, we're going to bring that. It's always a pleasure talking to you. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Yeah.